Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can download and install Blender on your Mac operating system. So let's get started and let's see how we can do it. So first of all, open your favorite browser and search for Blender. And the first link which will appear here will be from blender.org. So we are going to click on this link. Once you are on the Blender website, you will be able to see the download button here and you will also see the download link at the top. So I'm going to click on the download link at the top. Here you will be able to download the Blender DMG file for your Mac operating system. Now before clicking on the download button, you need to select which version of uh, Blender you want to download. So when you click on this drop down menu here, you can see there are two versions available here for the Mac operating system. So if you are using the Mac OS with the Intel processor, you can select this option in the drop down menu. If you are using the Mac OS with the Apple Silicon processors like M1 or M2, you can select the second option. By default, the option which is selected here is for the Apple Silicon. So when you click on this download Blender button, it will be downloaded for the Apple Silicon version. So if you are using Intel, just select this option instead of Apple Silicon. So as you can see, Apple Silicon is by default selected here. So I'm going to click on the download button, which is going to download the DMG file for the Blender. Once this DMG file is downloaded, I'm going to click on this file and then let me minimize the browser and this is the installer for the Blender. So here the installation process is really simple. You just need to drag this Blender icon in the applications folder. So select the Blender icon here. And if you are using trackpad and your MacBook's keyboard, then press the command key and drag this icon on top of your uh, applications folder. So once you do that, your Blender will be copied to the applications folder. Once it's copied into the applications folder, I can close this window and then I can go to my launch pad and here I will be able to see the Blender icon. I can also search for the Blender application in the search bar and then I can open Blender from here. So you can see Blender is opening. Just wait for a few seconds until it opens fully and you can see Blender has been launched successfully on my Mac operating system. For the first time when you uh, open Blender application, you will see this quick setup window here. You can uh, change the language from here. So by default, English is selected in my case. If you want to change the language, then you can change the language from here. You can also set the shortcut, which is Blender in my case. You can also set the select with option. By default, it's left. I'm going to leave it as left. And also you have the option to select the space bar. So here by default, it's play, but you can also select tool or search here. I'm going to leave everything as default. Also, if you want to change the Blender into the light theme, you can change it from here. I generally like my Blender to be in the darker theme, so I can select the dark theme here and then click on continue. And then you can see, uh, you can create a new file. You can create a new general file, 2D animation, uh, VFX, video editing. So all these options are available here. Whatever you want to do, you can uh, uh, create that file from here or you can open your existing project using this open button. You also have the manual for Blender. You also have tutorial section. So when you click on this tutorial, you will be able to view some uh, tutorials here. And if you don't want to do anything, just click anywhere else on your Blender application and you will be able to see the Blender window. Here, you can start working with Blender. So this is how you can download and install Blender on your Mac operating system. I hope you've enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next video.